Hi guys and girls, John here. In this video, I'm just going to show you some of the planned videos that are coming up and I'll just give you a quick sneak peek into what we're doing in the back end of Savri and how we make the videos. The reason I'm making this video is because someone actually left a comment and asked why it's taken so long to produce these videos. So I'm just going to give you a little bit of insight into that. So here's a spreadsheet. Everyone hates spreadsheets, let's face it, everyone's got thousands of these. But you can see on our one that what we've got are stages, tasks, responsibilities and comments. And essentially this is how we plan our video production schedule. We actually have these tasks here and then we've got the people who do the tasks and then there's some comments on the right here. So there's quite a lot of tasks to do per video and there's quite a lot of team coordination into doing them. For example, Mo, he's the one who creates the 3D models. We have to order the 3D models from Mo well in advance because it takes a while to make them. Mo actually flips out whenever we ask for a model within say two or three days because he's an artist and he wants to perfect it and he wants it to be the best it can be and he can't work under these conditions. And sometimes he sends a message such as, John, I'm gonna kill you if this happens ever again. And this is just the way we normally work. The images are made by Max or Nasia, and Zach does some video editing from time to time, and Mickey does as well. So there's quite a lot that needs to be done to produce a single video. We've now got this publishing schedule, and that's something that I want to try and stick to over the coming months because I'm a little bit slack when it comes to producing these videos. We don't really have a timeline, we don't really have any specific schedule. And that's why we're not producing as many videos as we should be, which is pretty frustrating because we need to do that if we want to grow on YouTube. As well as that, I realize for you guys and girls who are watching these videos, you know, you want them a little bit more often, maybe once a week or twice a week if possible. And we really need to start producing more and more videos on time to keep everyone happy. So what have we got planned? We've got a large two-stroke marine video planned for next week on Sunday. We've got a how piston air compressors work video planned for the week after that. Piping flange types, faces and surfaces. That's planned for the week following. And then something totally different, how boiler water reactors work. That's planned on about the 11th of April. You can see we've got a little note at the top here. It tells you when your viewers on YouTube are online. And that's the reason why we're trying to produce the videos for 9 a.m. on Sunday, because there's a lot of people online on a Sunday, and Sunday's a nice relaxing day, so it gives people a bit of time to watch the video. So that's how we produce the videos and some of the planning that goes into them. If we go over to this other tab, Video Course Schedule. We've actually got a lot of video courses that we're going to prioritize as well over the coming months. Piping Flange Fundamentals, that will probably be online within the next week. It's about four hours long. The induction motor video course, that's also going to be online within about three to four weeks. Electrical bushings, air compressors, boilers, steam turbines, gas turbines, and many other interesting engineering topics. So keep a look out for those video courses because they're gonna be posted onto our YouTube channel as well in the members area, as well as on savory.com. So I hope that gives you a little bit of insight into what we're doing at our end. I appreciate everyone watching the videos. And I really appreciate the feedback and comments that everyone gives. It's really nice to know that these videos are actually helping people and they find them interesting and educational. So a big thanks from me and also the team, everyone involved. Without the team, I wouldn't actually be able to produce these videos. Thank you very much for your time. And we will reconnect next Sunday for the large two-stroke marine diesel engine video. Bye for now.